Look guys, and on today's video, we're gonna be going over the stack frame call. Let's see if the camera focus in on that. Yeah, that's it. See, it's got two separate frames in between the, in between the reeds. And to me, I personally, I cannot run this call and it aggravates the crap out of me. But I know I can kill a turkey with it because of the sound it produces. I mean, I can't really get a real raspy sound of it, but I've got a friend of mine that runs them. I had to make him pull a bag of them. I'm telling you, they're a pain in the butt to make. But I just wanted to go over it on today's video and just tell y'all a little bit about them. And, and on the next segment, segment after I get done telling y'all about this call I'm gonna tell y'all how you order calls from me because I've had a lot of comments on the last videos that people can't get up with me to to order calls so but yeah this call it's got two separate frames if y'all can't see but all it is is two sheets of true prophylactic latex and on I use flat frames but that's just a little different frame from what normal calls are built with. See, let me see if I can find the normal call. All right, so that's a normal V cut. See how the frame's got little edges and all on it? The flat frames, this call has no edge on it. I can't remember what the heck those other frames are called, but that's how this is made. But it's true prophylactic latex. I have it stretched loose. A lot looser than what I usually use on my calls. But to me, it gave it a little bit of better sound. I didn't want it to squeal as much. So I lightened up on the on the tension on the call. So, But I'm going to let y'all listen to it here for a second. And then we'll talk about it some more. See, it's good for tree ups. See, that's what I was doing. It gets real soft. It doesn't have a lot of rasp in your tree up, but but you don't really want to rasp in your tree up. You want it just soft, like she's just waking up off the limb. But it can get a little bit louder too. See, I know I don't sound good on it, so don't start bashing me in the comments because of how bad I sound on it. I just wanted to do a little review over the call, but I know it don't sound good to me because I can't run it. You may be able to run it, but I can't. That's for dang sure. But I can't really get rasp out of it. Like that first set of yips, it had a lot of rasp, and I had no clue how the heck I did that, but... You know, some calls are good for some people. That's like, I may, my favorite call is set back that way. Your favorite call may be a dang ghost or a dang three read, four read, P cut. It's all in what matches you and your mouth frame and what you can call on best. But, you know, a friend of mine, he, he kills turkeys with this call every year. And he texts me and asked me if I'd build him a bunch of them. And I said, yeah, of course. So, but yeah, this call, it can do a lot of stuff, but it can also gobble. If it can't do nothing else for me, it can gobble. And, I mean, that can get a turkey fired up like nothing else can. I mean, that's something we're going to get jealous and come in there full sprint. 
trying to whoop another turkey's tail. Because that turkey's trying to get with his hen, but. I mean, this call, I know it'll call up a turkey. You ain't gotta ask me. I mean, if you catch that turkey on the right day, right conditions, everything's perfect. I mean, that turkey will come in to literally partner anything. I've had turkeys like that. Last year, I called in six. And I know it was just that right moment. They were all grouped together. All their hens had left them. And they just came in there just strutting, gobbling. And walked up 20 steps and shot one of them in the head. So, I mean, it's all in right conditions for them. But I know turkey season here in Bama opens up Monday. Been scouting a lot, doing a lot of that. We're gonna have some videos coming out for this turkey season. I know I'm guiding youth season. I'm gonna try to get a friend of mine's nephew his first turkey. So that's what's coming up on the agenda. I'm gonna try to film it. I'm gonna try to get it out here for y'all. But this call, also, like I said, I have no clue how people how people run it, but. I'll just try to do my best and run it for y'all. I sound terrible on that <laughs> I know y'all are probably going to be in the comments. Why are you making videos? If you if you can't run the call, don't make videos. I'm just out here trying to produce content for y'all. Because I know that last video I made, I've had several orders for that setback back wing. And I tell y'all what, I love that call. That call sounds amazing. I've got another call up here that sounds great too. I've got a little, little trash pile of calls up here on my desk from calls that I made that that I can't really run good, but this one call, yeah, here it is, here it is. I ain't got a clue what to call this son of a gun, and I'm not even sure if I can break it open or run it for you. Yeah, let's see, I got it broke. Look at that funky gut. I tell y'all what, that's like a double snake tongue or something like that. Just playing around building some calls. And you never know what the heck you might find in a shop. Y'all can give it a listen. Heck, if you want it, just let me know. I mean, y'all might think this thing sounds amazing. I mean, it does. It will call up a turkey. That's for nature. He's a ripper, tell you that. I mean, that is a good sounding call, too, in my name. Yeah, I'll just, I'll pull all these calls down and I'll show them to you. My dang, my cool pal, pal. I don't even know why they that calls on my cool pal. I'll just throw it up there. I think I might stick that call out to the side. Yeah, let me get them all gathered and gathered up for you. Let's see. I mean, that's just the, the hair end of them. 
I mean, I've got a bag in here in my fridge. And I'll show you. Look at all them dolls. I mean, that is a true cool pile of mouth calls. And that's what happens when you build your own calls. You try every freaking call. I mean, every different cut, every different stretch. You always want to try. You always want to make sure you produce a great product. Too. That's for dang sure. If you produce a great product, people will come. And I believe I produce a great product. I haven't had a single person yet tell me that, hey, your call sucks. <laughs> I don't know if most people ain't going to tell you that, but... I ain't have one of their friends come tell me that they suck either, so. I mean, I've had nothing but great, great reviews on my calls, so. Yeah, yeah, I'm fixing to put that in my pile for the good calls. But, yeah, all right, so. To wind down this video, I'm gonna tell y'all how to order from me. All right, so, I'm on all social media platforms. Well, for the most part. I mean, I don't have Twitter. I mean, why the heck do I need Twitter to sell a turkey call? So, I've got Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. You can look me up on Facebook. Hop and Tom Game Calls. That's one, one page. That's my business page. You can look me up on there. Tristan Hargraves. Same name that's on this YouTube. I'm on there. Just... Follow me and send me a message. You ain't even got to follow me. I mean, just send me a message if you want to call. Instagram, Hoppin' Tom Game Calls. Follow me on there and send me a message. TikTok, Tristan Hargraves is my main account. But my business account is Hoppin' Tom Game Calls. So, I mean, y'all just go, go give it a follow. I mean... TikToks, I do a lot of tutorials on there. A lot more stuff than I do on this, on this channel. I mean, there's a lot of stuff on there that I was really did not feel like posting on here. But if y'all want to see more content, just comment down here. I mean, tell me what the heck y'all want to see. I mean, if there's a certain call you want me to build, I mean, it can be a funky cut. All you gotta do is drop a comment, send me a picture of it. And I mean, I will try it. I'm down to try anything. I mean, heck, I'm not the world's best caller. I'm not no freaking Matt Man Sice by a long shot. I mean, I mean, some of y'all might think I'm great. But I know Matt's amazing. I know a good friend of mine, Bodie Blissett, he can run that daggum houndstooth all pro like no other. I'm telling you, that son of a gun's good. Dang, Dave Owens, Lord. I ain't never seen somebody run a mouth call like he does. But, I mean, there is a lot of turkey killers in this world. And they ain't sounding like none of them. I mean, we're all running these contests to try to sound exactly like the best we can as a live hen in the woods. And all hens sound different. So, I mean, you never know. One day you might show up to a competition and judges might score you higher than the next. Judges might score you way the heck lower, too. I mean, it's all in what the judges say it sounds real. But, I mean, I'm just rambling on now, just talking. But, you know, there's a lot of things that you can do to better yourself calling. I know I might try here in the near future to do, to do a YouTube video on how to yelp. I know I watched Troy Ruiz his videos when I first started when he's on Primos Primos how to use a mouth call that's what you need to look up if you want to learn how and I mean that man can run a mouth call and he kills a lot of turkeys too I mean he comes up here where I live hunting with a friend of mine and they kill a lot of turkeys so I mean hit, hit me up like I said, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. Message me on any of them to order. I make any cuts you can imagine. If 
if there's a specific cut, specific stretch, like there's dang stack frame calls I made for him. I mean, if there's something like that you want, just message me. I will try to, I will try my dangness to figure out how to make them for you. And if I can't make them, man, I'm sorry. But, heck, I will at least may try to, try to help you out on something different. I mean, try to get you something that you can run good. But, you know, just out here in the shop. Got a lot of stuff going on this week. I mean, turkey season open on Monday. I mean, gum. I mean, this most exciting part of the year, man. I mean, you get to go watch a gobby strut up in front of you. You might even get a sense of lead through them. I mean, you never dang know. Also, got, got some dang tube calls here. I mean, if any of y'all want a tube call, I've got them. I mean, I don't know how much I'm going to sell these things for. Don't know. Really don't know. But I mean, if y'all want a tube call, hit me up. I'll send you one. If you want stickers, got stickers too. They're not in the shop right now. I've got them over there at my house. But, I mean, heck, if there is any content y'all want, just let me know. But, Sorry, I kind of random <laughs> rambled on a lot longer than what I expected this video to be. Stack frame, true proof, both frames, single read. That's all this call video is supposed to be on, I mean. Lord have mercy. If y'all can't tell, I can freaking talk. That's one of my strong suits. I have very good social skills. And I like to talk. Especially if it's about turkeys. I can talk for hours. I sat at a friend's house talking about this turkey for five hours the other day. If that tells you anything. Also, I'm going to try to have some some hats coming in pretty soon. going to try. I'm going to try. I mean, money's kind of tight with a new business. But y'all know how that works. I mean, you should. But who knows? Who knows? Dang. Here, I'll give y'all an example of the company logo if you're looking for it on social media. That's it right there. If you're looking for me on social media, that's the logo you need to be looking for. But yeah, all right. Payment methods. Payment methods. If you, if you have these two payment methods, you can order calls from me. I haven't gotten any others yet. I plan on it. Though. I've got PayPal and Venmo. That's what you need to order from me. I mean, unless if you're here local, close enough to me, I can just get the money from you. But, uh, yeah, my payment methods are PayPal, Venmo. Plan on getting cash out here pretty soon, but that's in the future. We're in the we're in the present, planning for a future, planning for opening weekend at turkey season. I mean, who the heck else ain't planning for that? I mean, Mississippi, man, if our turkey season was open right now, that'd be amazing. But Mississippi, South Florida, North Florida, I mean, they their turkey season's coming way the heck earlier than South Alabama. I mean, I don't know why, but they do. But thank y'all for tuning in. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. If y'all want more videos like this, please let me know in the comments. If y'all want more tutorial videos, let me know. If y'all want to see more about Goblin, let me know. But please hit like, subscribe button if you want more content like this. Let me know. Thank you.